Hey everybody, guess what? It is back to Fax Man Friday. What that means is we're back to playing college basketball. After a very successful college football uh, campaign, we're back to what we do best. Usually we started this with, you know, the Fax Man Friday. For the guys that know it, it's Fax at the Mac. It's my conference. You ladies, you know me as Fax in the Sack. Both of them, very prosperous for both people, men and women. So quick thing on college basketball, so a lot of people know. You know, a lot of times a lot of people get confused on the wins and losses in, in college basketball. You're not going to get a, a video from me saying seven years ago this team is 0-7 or 7-0 versus the spread because when I'm dealing with 18-year-old kids, these kids were 11 when these trends or stats had taken place. What's important to me as a handicapper is – What's going on head-to-head? -head? Matchups are real key. There are certain players that own other players. There are certain teams that own certain teams. And there are certain situations that you have to apply. So, yeah, I like head-to-head -head matchups. I like to know what's happening the last couple of weeks. I'm not real big on what happened against the spread over the last couple of years, kind of like football. Or I'm not really even concerned about what happened, you know, two months ago because teams kind of find grooves. All right, enough of that nonsense. Let's get back to the game. Mac Friday, we have Sienna at home against Ryder. Ryder is going to be about probably a one-point favorite. Now, I'm shooting this on Wednesday, so I don't know for sure what this line is. I'm just giving an estimated guess that Ryder might be a small favorite. I made the number Ryder minus six, so I think they'll win by 10 either way. Quick things on the game. Uh, Sienna has not won a home game this year, 0-3 at home. There are only two wins on the year. Uh, and this is a two and seven team. They played Navy, who there's probably not a guy more than six foot on that team. And Northern Kentucky, don't mistake it for Kentucky. This is Northern Kentucky. Okay, that's probably like a Baptist school or something down in Kentucky. They probably don't have any players there either. Anyway, Ryder um, has been more tested this year. Played some better teams, and I like the way they've handled themselves. Five and four. Nice five-day rest, of, not rest, of practice, which is is important to me. Sienna played on Tuesday night where they were just manhandled by a St. Bonnie's team who ain't worth much anyway. But but some things that I'm looking at and um, that I like. When I said head-to-head, -head, last year, Ryder put 83 on Sienna. And, and two teams of tempo, okay? Uh, this Ryder team likes to play the game in the 70s. They like to play that 73-74 type. Sienna cannot play that kind of basketball. They can't win. So what, what I'm looking at here is trying to find a way where, where Sienna can get to the 70-point level. And if they do, it's a shootout. They're going to lose anyway. And it won't happen. So my play, it's a road team in the MAC. It's Ryder. Lay a point, lay two, whatever your, your number is. I'm not concerned about it. I think they win this game easily. So that's going to be our first play to kick off the college basketball campaign. It's Ryder versus Siena. So we'll finish off with this. Ryder on Friday and also play the game. Visit me, www.sportsforumpicks.com. That's where you can find me. That's home. Stop by. Contest. A lot of free stuff. Some comp games. Get over there. It's free to join, like I say all the time. For Don Best. This is the Faxman saying, have a great day, good luck, and a prosperous weekend.